Hello, everyone. The topic of my report is creating molecular subtypes of breast cancer using multimodal deep learning and incorporation of the attention mechanism. I am the reporter Ming Yuzhang. I will report from the following parts. Next, let's look at the first part, introduction. According to the、uh, statistics for 2020. In human cancers, the incidence of female breast cancer is 11.7 percent, ranking first in the world. As shown in Figure One, in women,、uh, the incidence and、uh, mortality of breast cancer are higher than other cancers. One in four cancer cases and one in six cancer deaths. Ranking first among cancers. More importantly, the incidence of breast cancer is still growing rapidly. According to different receptors and protein expression levels, breast cancer can be divided into four molecular subtypes called luminal A, luminal B, HER2 enriched, and a triple negative. The molecular subtypes of breast cancer is an important factor for the prognosis of breast cancer patients, and can guide treatment selection. In recent years, with the development of artificial intelligence, some studies have shown that deep learning-based methods can potentially be used to Predict molecular subtypes of breast cancer. However, most previous studies only analyzed, analyzed single modality images and didn't integrate features from different image modalities.、Uh, in this work, a purpose is to develop a deep learning based model for predicting the molecular subtypes of breast cancer. Using multimodal imaging analysis, combining、uh, mammography and ultrasound.、Uh, next, let's look at the second part.、Mm, first,、uh, we collected 864 pairs of breast cancer cases at Netherlands Cancer、uh, Institute, including mammography and the corresponding ultrasound. Images. A figure two shows the data screening process.、Uh, then we designed a multimodal deep learning model. First,、uh, we obtained the location of the lesion、uh, according to the label marked by a dedicated breast、uh, radiologist.、Uh, two wheels of mammography and.、Uh, An ultrasound image of each case are used as input.、Uh, then、uh, we combine RESTAT and、uh, attention mechanism as the, the feature extractor. Finally, all the features are combined、uh, to predict the molecular subtypes. Of breast cancer. Uh, next, let's take a look at the results. Uh, figure four uh, shows the confusion matrix and the RC curve.、Uh, the MCC was 0.794 uh, for predicting four class molecular subtypes of breast cancer. And the AOC was 0.855 for distinguishing between luminal and non-luminal disease. Table two compares the、uh, previous uh, research and a、uh, study.、Uh, the results show that、uh, the image-based deep learning method is better than the results、uh, based on genetic biomarkers and various、uh, features. Multimodal imaging shows better performance than single 
model imaging, and the retention mechanism is shown to further improve the performance of our model. Finally, we generated heat maps using the class activation mapping method. It can be seen that a model focuses on the information of the living area of mammography and ultrasound, including the center edge of the leader and so on. The above is also content of this report. Uh, thanks for your attention.